Hey everybody, welcome back to Chaosville. It's hey. Skin, the Mean Machine, Killer Bean what on up? the scene. You know what I mean, James Dean, but super keen, not quite as mean. Magic missile! What the frick are you doing? Oh! You son of a gun! Come here, icicle, icicle! Oh, I missed! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, me and Duncan have been messing around with Ars Magica. Arse. And we built we built ourselves a cool little um, spell altar. But this episode, what are we doing this episode, Duncan? We got to, do, we, do we want to level up our skills? More spells! More spells! Well, there's some other More. there's some other multi-block structures in my... Oh, look, look how berry bush has grown. God, it's huge. And all our carrots. Do, do they get bigger then? Looks like it. They're huge. That's cool. What do we do with the berries? Do we eat them? I just eat them all. You've just eaten them all. Mm, well, you did say you were hungry. Look at all this food, Shin. Um, I've already got loads of cooked pork chops anyway, so I'm not I'm not too fussed. Um, but I might try some of these berries because I'm a bit hungry myself. Mm, nom 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 nom. Oh. Nom 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 nom. I thought I took them all. Took, no, you didn't. You missed a couple. Because uh, you were scrub. Yeah. Now, uh, <laughs> wow. What are you doing? Did you take out all the? Oh, good job. Good job. Are you going to replant those? Of course. Of course. I've got a hoe. Don't need a hoe. You don't need a hoe. Yo ho ho. Just leave the dirt bits on their own, like that. Screw it. So this episode we're going to dig a bit more into Ars Magica, isn't that right? That is correct. And I'm going to read through this book because there's a multi-block um, a multi-block um, structure that we can build that just generates essence over time. Oh, what's essence for? Essence, I think, goes as uh, its spell components, I think. Okay. Is there a way to regenerate mana? That's what we need. That's what we really need. I think there must be some kind of mana potion, right? A good way to level up, wouldn't it? So um, we could try and look for those, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through this book because it's got the R's, Magicka UI, your first spell, spell components 101, gaining magic levels, obtaining skill points, dungeons and exploring. Okay. But it's got the essence system then here. And there's a multi-block structure that we can build that gets generates essence for us over time. I'm not, Let's build it. I'm not really sure what that means, though. Ars, I'm just going to read this out. Ars magic contains a unique power system called essence. Um, are you following me so far? No. All right, well, I'll start again. The, <laughs> you asshole. <laughs> Basically, essence is generated from a nexus, and the nexus will stream to other powered blocks within a 10-block radius. To extend the range of your nexus, you can place essence conduits. Sounds a bit complicated, right? It does. Let's do it. Yeah, it does. Let's do it. <laughs> Reconstructors, ETC, can... Oh, man, this looks really complicated. But I think you can start off with just a simple essence generator. Okay. But I don't know how you make it. <laughs> it doesn't say. It doesn't say. It's supposed to say. <laughs> um, oh. Modifiers, components, shapes, blocks, mechanics, guides. Here's guides. Here we are. No, wait. Mechanics. First ball. Oh, stop doing that. Oh, you got your mana back. Stand still. Let me hit you. Okay. Boo. You moved. <laughs> I, I, you didn't, didn't cast anything either. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Stop moving. Did I get you? Nope. You ass. Yeah. Ah, oh, you got In me. In the face. Oh, I get. I got, I got XP for being hit by it, I think. Oh, wow. Hit me again. Are you not getting hit by that? I just shot that directly at your face. I don't think you're shooting it. You must have run out of mana. No, I had full mana, but it wouldn't let me... Oh, that's weird. Um, well, maybe you get it... Oh, ow! Did you get XP for that? Did I get XP? I, I think I did, actually, yeah. Hit me again. No, I don't think I did. Maybe I did. Yeah. Oh, well. Uh, I need to go and find some animals to shoot my lightning at. Okay, well, there's structures here at the bottom. I found it, right. Okay, if you work on that... Yeah. And I'll, and I'll work on... Getting better at magic. There's also something we can build called a gateway, and I think that's basically like a teleporter. Ooh, mm. that'd be great. Although we can teleport at will. Do you think we should do that? It's a bit cheaty, isn't it? I think we should stop. We did do it an awful lot. We had a look around and we played around with it, but I think we should stop now because we didn't do too much with it. You got some ink and we looked at Will Strife's stuff, but that's about it. Yeah. Level 10! All right, well, I'm going to make... I'm going to make a light nexus. Oh, yeah. Oh, this uses one of those runes that was on the floor. Remember the, the runes that someone built for us? Oh, yeah. How, do you know how you build them? Yeah, I'm looking at a book right now. Oh, the rune itself on the floor. No, I don't know. Well, at least we got some. Yeah, we can just use the one downstairs. That's pretty cool. Light Nexus is by far the weakest of the three, but is the most easily attainable, oh. as well as the most reliable. Okay. So to create the middle rune, oh, you simply craft white chalk and you right-click on top of a block. Oh, easy. To make the rune at that position. That's cool. So yeah, I don't, I don't know how hard white chalk is to make, <laughs> but I'd guess probably quite easy, because it's chalk, right? You just find it. Chalk. 
and drawing essence out of the atmosphere, the light nexus will serve to increase the purity of an area. Oh, cool! So we can make like a pure area of like awesomeness and, and light. Might chalk. You use bone meal, arcane ash, flint, clay, and paper. It's actually quite hard. Oh wow! Are we going to be white wizards? Let's be white wizards. That sounds good. I want to be a black black wizard. Well, you can't, Duncan. You weren't born that way. Like a dark, like a black mage. Oh right, okay. I want to be, I want to be Vivi. V- who? Vivi. Who? From Final Fantasy Nine. Nine. I didn't play that one. I played the um, oh. the better one. Ten. Lulu. <laughs> Ten sucked. Just, oh my god. Lulu was way more attractive than Vivi. Lulu was terrible. All the characters in Ten were terrible. If anyone tries to tell me differently, I'll, I'll cover my ears. <laughs> oh, well, okay. I'm going to build one of these light nexuses, <laughs> and it looks pretty simple. I just need quartz, okay. uh, like glass, and a rune. Now, how do I get quartz? It's definitely quartz that I need. Uh, you just mine it, I think. I've got some Certus quartz. Is that what you need? No, it's like actual quartz blocks. Oh, what's this? There's a. Wait, I think our, our bottle's been upgraded. No, it hasn't been upgraded. It's just. Um... I think it's a vanilla Minecraft thing, isn't it? Quartz. Yeah, it is. It's just like a normal block. Uh, nether quartz. You combine four nether quartz, quartz to get a block of quartz. Uh. Nether quartz. So that's one thing. We can go to the nether. That's one way of doing it. Uh, I'm not sure if there's quartz that spawns naturally in the overworld. Oh, we might have to go to the nether, but that's scary because the nether in uh, the nether in Resonant Rise is super hardcore. Oh, but there's quartz like everywhere in the nether, so you shouldn't have to go too far. Oh, is there? Yeah. Okay, right. Well, that's my mission then, to get to the nether to get some quartz blocks, but I'm going to need some obsidian to do that. Going to the nether, we go into the nether. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that song that was like Ken, Ken US, wasn't it? Yeah. Great. Yeah, yeah. Great stuff. Have we got any obsidian lying around? We haven't mined any yet. So I've got like a diamond pick, but I haven't got any obsidian. Oh. What are you going to do then? Are you going to look into like mana potions and how we can get mana back so we can cast some more spells to get more levels? I guess I should, shouldn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's some really cool combinations actually. Lewis was showing me some cool Ars Magica combinations that you can get. You can get Touch Dig, which lets you dig anything with a spell rather than using a pick. Really? And if you had, like, unlimited mana, yeah, 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 and it's instant, I think. Mm. So if you had, like, unlimited mana, you could be, like, a super powerful digger. That's pretty cool. I'm going to need a bucket, then, a buckets of water to to pour some water onto obsidian, uh, onto lava to make obsidian to dig it up. Right. So where am I going to get a bucket from? Let's see if I can find that. And you're going to make mana potions, did you say? I don't know how, but I'll give it a go. It can't be too hard. There must be... Take a look in the book. In, in the Ars Magica Compendium, It's it's there's loads of stuff. If you just go back to... Um, where are we? Oh, whoops. If you just go back to... How do you go back to the, fir- the first page? You can't go back to the... Oh, there we go. Back. Yeah, all the, all the things on the left. There's Yeah, there's guides, mechanics, items, blocks, shapes, components, modifiers, mobs. Items. Manic... Potions. There we go, mana potions. Lesser mana potion. Wheat grain uh, or seeds. Sugar. Sugar and a stinky potion. Stinky potion. Do you know how to make stinky potions? No, I don't. Probably zombie brains or something comes into ha- it comes into use though. I've never been good at potions in Minecraft because they've been they're just so complicated. Yeah. <laughs> and they like the gain is not that great for what you get. No, it's not. They're like short term effects. They're good for PvP. But that's about it. Yeah, I mean, I've used them before, like when they've been spawned in and in maps and stuff. But yeah, I've never really gone and brewed them. It just seems like a lot of effort. It does, doesn't it? I'm gonna take a block of. We haven't got much iron, you know, much, much like kind of loose iron. I, I sh- one bucket should be enough though to get a uh, enough obsidian. Yeah, that's right. Oh no, creeper die! Is there anything else we can do? Is there, is there any other way we can regen mana without having to? Uh... Um, well, I'll have a look in the book again, but I, mean, I could work out how to do a stinky potion. Um, uh, stinky potion. There's also because I think the other mana potions use the lesser ones, and yeah, they do. Uh, so and add things to them. But there's also a thing called a mana cake. Yeah. Um, gives a boost of mana regeneration. Oh, that might be good. But I've no idea how to make it. It's just the, the crafting is just. Oh. The cake. Rude dude spotted. Shoot to kill. <laughs> the crafting recipe is just a cake. Or maybe you just need to make a cake then and you just put it back in there. No, I mean like just the cake, the mana cake. Oh, just oh, right. on its own. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't know what to do about that then. Look at it. Look at look at this goddamn. There's just what the hell is this? Testosterone cake. Testosterone. What? 
Was it? Not these like vials of oh my god chemicals. T T two mice mycotoxin. T H C cake. T H C cake. What the <laughs> hell? Oh my god. I drug, some of that. Drug craft <laughs> up in this mother trucker. Stay away. Stay away from the weed cake. You're not making any weed cake. This is ours, Magica. Oh my god. Oh, here we go. I found an actual recipe for it. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm like page twelve. <laughs> 12, right? How do you make it? <laughs> so you need a blue orchid, a desert nova, some sugar, and a wheat. Ah, blue orchid. It seems quite expensive, because those flowers are needed a lot in, like, spell recipes. Yeah. And we've only got two of them. Ooh. And we've only got one desert nova. Oh dear. Is it, like, a thing for whenever you join a server to do a zero and then, like, a forward slash? It's like a wave, isn't it? Because we, we haven't been doing that, have we? No. I found some gold. We're total bitches, actually, aren't we? Gold's good. Well, you know... <laughs> We're doing our own thing. Doing our own thing. Ain't no thing. Okay, let's work out to do potions, shall we? Potion. Yeah. There might be a better way to regen mana. There might be a spell that regens mana, although that sounds kind of dumb, doesn't it? A spell to make you cast more spells. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. No. Oh, I found a, I found a, a little underground uh, railroad thing, you know, a, an abandoned mine. Oh, cool. Look around that. It's probably some good ores. Yeah, there might be some chests as well with stuff. Oh, there's some gold. Brewing stand, stone and a blaze rod. And blaze rod shin. Oh, that's tough. That's really hard to get. You're going to the nether? Well, we are actually, yeah. So that's we could try and get some of that. Looks like we're going on a nether trip. What's that song about the nether? That that, that guy sung, Martin Littlewood? Nether, 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 never. Never. Nether. Yeah. Never go to the nether, because it sucks more than ever. <laughs> pretty much it isn't it yeah it's, that's pretty much what he says mm. it's the message i took away from it at least yeah me too me too i think it's the important part of the song yeah N never go to the nether not, not to go to the nether <laughs> sucks i met a girl called heather she was pretty fine we'll be together forever oh wait i was singing about the nether not heather uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's oh. a terrible song yeah it is I need some, some armour and stuff and bows if we're going to go to the nether. You reckon? Yeah. Well, all we really need is quartz from the nether, plus oh, a blaze rod, so you need to kill blazes, so yeah. We need to, yeah, we need to find a bloody thing to the blaze rod, don't we? Like a, a fortress. Can't... Oh, I'm just going to... Oh, stinky potion. Oh. It must be a better way of making a stinky potion. You would have thought. Potion. Why don't you just, like, fart near a potion? Would that work? You think it would, wouldn't you? Well, no, I, I don't don't really think it would, but... <laughs> fart into it. Fart into it, yeah, fart into a bottle. And then put a cap on it. There you go, stinky potion. Where's the potion? Open it up. I can't even find it in the bloody list. I got one obsidian. How many more do I need? <laughs> like, 11. Oh, God. <laughs> no, you, don't, you need 10 obsidian to get another portal, isn't it? Yeah, that's for the crap ones. Which, well, we could build a crap one. I'm, I'm not going I'm not... I'm not... I'm not Fussy or picky. <laughs> it's not even in the recipe list as mana potion, is it? Or is that it? Standard mana potion. Standard. 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 Lesser mana potion. Ooh. Oh, it looks like you can use any potion to make it. Oh, right. Oh, okay. That, that, that makes it easier then. That's a little bit better. Oh, there's loads of gold down here. Should I get the gold? Is gold valuable to us? It is, isn't it? Yeah. We still need a brewing stand there, so we do need a blaze rod. All right. Right. You, you need a blaze rod for a brewing stand. It's yeah, I know, and that's eh? Never knew that. Yeah. Oh, what's this gold stuff? There's some gold stuff here. It is. It's gold. Chimerite. Ooh. Chimerite, I guess. Oh, I've never had that before. No? Looks pretty cool. Oh, I might meet one of those weird dudes down here, one of those peshies. A pesh. A pesh. Pesky, pesky man. Pesky pesh, yeah. Pesky peshes. It's a shame our last pet ran away. What, it, what, a, what an asshole. <laughs> What, is what do you think would happen, right, if um, one day a bear walked into the Vatican while they were voting for the Pope and somehow nobody realised but they accidentally voted for a bear to be the Pope? Like a real bear. I think they'd probably um, cancel. Cancel the Pope. The Pope's been cancelled. Catholicism is cancelled. <laughs> Catholicism? Yeah. Catholicism. They, well, they wouldn't let it stand, would they? They couldn't just have a bear as a pope. Why not? Why not have a bear as a pope? It's probably in the rule book somewhere. 
No, no bears. <laughs> thou, thou shalt not make a pope thine uh, a bear, bear thine pope. Yeah. Well, what if what if it was Yogi Bear? Yogi Bear's not real though. I think he'd make quite a good pope. <laughs> hey, 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 guys! I'm the pope. First things first, picnic baskets for everybody. Oh, I love picnics. Because he loves picnics, doesn't he? Yogi Bear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably. He's a bear. He is a bear. It's a bear. And that's why when you go camping in countries that have bears, you shouldn't leave food out because the Pope might come and eat it. Yeah. That's <laughs> what he does. You know that, just that, that saying, does the Pope shit in the woods? Turns out he does. <laughs> turns out he does. Because he's a bear. Because he's a bear. <laughs> turns, out, <laughs> turns out the Pope's a bear and he does shit in the woods. <laughs> and he steals your food. <laughs> oh... Best Pope, Pope, Best Pope 2012. <laughs> oh my God. I got you some Osmium leggings. They're nearly broken, but they're good. That sounds good. That sounds fancy. <laughs> Wait, you just found those on a zombie, didn't you? No. You jerk. Do you want a half-broken steel helmet? No. I don't want anything from you. You jerk. <laughs>